So if you've been following into Cowboys, you know we're all about experiences and there's a few things we just can't stay away from. We can't stay away from beer, we can't stay away from really good beef, meat, and you know Alberta is just a great place to do that. But it all happens somewhere. And today we're having a look at the Olds College training that they do for future and aspiring butchers. This is one of the few things that you can learn here and it makes this particular program apparently quite unique is the fact that they can do cured meats and they do their own sausages. Here is something that you don't get an awful lot. They call this Maui ribs and if you want to come to this shop and you want to get some of this you better be here early because we know every time we come here this is just about sold out. So if you came today, sorry about that guy, we're going to take more of it. We're the only program of our kind in North America. There's only one other like it in the world. Um, we teach everything from slaughter all the way through to the retail and the sausage making. We're drawing students from all over the world. We have students from Ethiopia, students from Nigeria, students from India, and a student from the United States in this particular class. You encourage people to start businesses, and I'm asking that question because Olds is a college that's well known for also including the business aspects to the trading. Um, most of the students come with that dream. What we do is try to help them achieve that by giving them the skills, knowledge, understanding of some, say some different techniques and stuff that we do so that they can be successful. So it's a 14 week program and when the students come in they have about two weeks of uh, classroom right off the bat and then after that then it's all hands on. Uh, a little bit of theory uh, throughout the week. One of the things that we do that other, no, no other school does is the uh, slaughter. We are the only program in North America that will train for slaughter. So they learn that side of it as well as they go into the full carcass cutting, break down the entire animal and then produce it into uh, cuts for custom or into the retail cuts that you see here. I'm intrigued by the right ventricle you've got on there. Yes. <laughs> um, I had to do partly with butchering. I figure butchering hearts kind of connect to it. What's the attraction to butchering? Because to be honest with you, if, if I bring butchering up with some of the young people, even, even the fellas, yeah. they're scared of it. They, they don't want to go there anymore. So why are you attracted to it? I have always enjoyed hands-on work. I grew up very young age. Uh, anytime we went hunting and my dad got anything, it was always my job to gut and skin it. So I, it was something that was ingrained into my culture uh, growing up. And so I knew that was what I wanted to do from a very young age. This is a recession group job, I think so, because they are related to the food industries. So that's why I joined there. So I enjoy my course because uh, the instructor are very good here, teaching very well. I'm working on starting my own butcher shop. I was actually a chef for a few years, but I didn't like the environment of it. And I ended up getting a job in a meat market, and this is exactly what I love. I was working on the farm a lot and stuff like that, and taking care of family. So this is something new for me, being in the workplace. So it's recession-proof, really. I've never seen a butcher out of work. So you can do the 15-week program, and you can immediately step into an apprenticeship somewhere, can you? Pretty much, yeah. Are there any of them that still focuses, wants to do that little butcher shop, the little deli? Because those are businesses that seem yes. to be disappearing, right? Yes, and they are. And that's kind of why that merchandising program has uh, started, and that's why we've introduced that. So that is a uh, major that the students are, uh, they have the option of taking instead of slaughter. Because some students don't need to learn the slaughter side of it, you know. Uh, with the way the meat industry is, uh, has evolved, you don't need to know how to kill the animal necessarily. They do more focus on running their own small shop. And once they leave here, the uh, training is just started really for them. It's, uh, there's a lot more that they need to learn and a lot of skills that need to be developed. What we do is we get the, uh, the initial training out of the way for them once they go into industry, then they can further their uh, skills there. 